Residents of Katsana State are heaving a sigh of relief following the construction of drainages that will help address the perennial flooding in the state. In the past few years, flood disasters have claimed lives and property annually as heavy rains wreak havoc across the state. But the narrative is about to change for good with the construction of the drainages as Trust TV's Abdullahi Yamadi reports from Katsina. Here's the report. Residents who are hopeful that these projects will be completed before the 2024 rainy season set in said they can now sleep with their two eyes closed, bearing in mind how devastated floods have been in the state over the years. The flooding often comes with loss of lives and property in the Kazana city, resulting in displacement of many residents, especially those living along the high-risk communities of Kofar Morusa, Kofar Dulibi, Kofar Sauri, Koramaranelli, and Kazira. This project has rekindled hope in the minds of not only people around the high-risk areas, but residents of the Asian city as a whole, assuring government that the work will be fully protected against vandals. We thank this administration for this project, and I believe this is the first time I have seen a project that touches on the lives of Katana residents directly. Many people lost their children, animals, and other vulnerables during flood disasters, which occurs almost every year. This gigantic project, when completed, people living around the streams will have peace of mind. Flooding, which often becomes a yearly occurrence, will be history. I must appreciate the Environment Ministry and Governor Diko Umarurada for executing the project. Kazana state government, through the Commissioner of Environment, Musa Adamu Funtua, assured that the project, according to contractual agreement, is expected to be completed in the next couple of weeks. The Commissioner of Environment also said the flood control project was jointly funded by Kazana state government, assuring that the water from the city will be harvested for irrigation fish farming and other purposes near Shinkafi village, a suburb of Kazana metropolis. So as far as I'm concerned, this kind of a life project for the entire people. Let me tell you, the lifespan of the project is going to spend 45 years. The quality of the project. Okay. How many times I tell you, how many of all of us have about 50? <laughs> so, so some of us, we have 55, 53. Yeah. So look at this. At the same time, I'm really happy. Today, even I go. I go out, go around in collaboration with the Commission of Land and Sabi. I see how the layman happy about the project. So being a privilege given to me as a supervising officer, I feel that to be in a something good is, is, is good in life. This initiative, when fully completed and implemented, will not only control the annual flooding devastating Kazana residents, but also provides job opportunities and food security for the state. Public commentators are asking the government to plant economic trees near the major drainages to control erosion, which will also beautify the affected areas. Abdullahi Ismayamadi, Trust Television News, Katana.